Hey, what's up guys? It's me, Nintega Gamer. Welcome back to some more Sly 3, Honor Among Thieves. Oh no, badly run! <laughs> no, no, don't hurt the poor disabled turtle. Wow, I shouldn't get hit. It's a freaking miracle. <laughs> but welcome back to more Sly 3, guys. In the last episode, guys, we got the gurus walking stick and moonstone back and oh yeah we rounded up some scorpions I was like what did we do I don't even remember today's episode guys we're gonna hopefully do some more missions starting off with meeting up with the guru with the Bentley where we're hopefully gonna be maybe on a, a spin mid air time maybe I'm thinking of Sly 3 or, or Sly 4 or something but anyway yeah, I just gotta figure a way up there with Bentley because, like I said, as my computer goes off. Oh, it's just. Wow, I actually grabbed the ledge. I wasn't even looking. <laughs> um, oh, perfect. Yeah. Um, we need to go unleash, unleash the guru. Hail, oh guru of the stone! Murray has purified Ayers Rock, and now I humbly deliver your walking stick and moonstone. The time for escape has come. Ooh, da, da. Thank you, you're too kind. But tell me, how do you plan to escape? Over da, in da. Gadzooks! You can transform yourself! Why, once you change shape, a guard is sure to come inside and investigate! Hey, Rafa Honda! Hi, Rafa Honda! Too true! Wait, here comes a guard! Master, hold down the L1 button to transform! I love it when you do that! Alright, guys, we're finally playing as a brand new Sly character! And this is super cool. So this is the guru. He has the ability to mess with your mind. So let's transform. What? Where'd he go? Master, you're the greatest! That jump's totally fooled! Once his back is turned, use your powers to take over his mind. Now we just gotta wait for this doofus to turn around, so safe for me. I'm having some really bad luck with this. Also, that is a bizarre color scheme for a kangaroo. Alright, come on, turn around. That or fall asleep, please. Is this guy not gonna turn around? Luckily, we can just disappear whenever we want. I'm really not getting luck of the draw on this. Holy crap. Also, you uh, randomly change objects, so that's really funny. Oh, I almost had it. Just turn around, you jackass! Oh my gosh. Ram him into the cell door! Free Boop! Awesomeness! Let's show these miners who's boss. Head for the drills. I guess Bentley's found a weak spot. So there you go, guys. That's what the guru can do. You can grab any enemy you want from behind and ride them crazy. It, it, they basically become a vehicle for you. You can go BAM right into other enemies. And you don't even have to worry about other enemies seeing you, which is awesome. Like, look, that guy doesn't even care. It's great. Oh my gosh. The only thing is... You're always moving. You can't really stay still. And you can actually take advantage of what that enemy's move is too. So it's 
awesome. And then literally, you could just blend right into your environment, even if you're caught. Just go poof, and everyone's like, where'd you go? So the guru is awesome to be able to play as. I think we gotta let this body go, though. So, yeah, just run into a wall or run him off a cliff and you'll be good. Your talents are impressive, guru. Uh-huh, yeah. I hear you. Those drills are tearing up the landscape. They appear to be fragile at the base. Ram a guard into it, and the whole apparatus should break apart. Oh, yeah. Some things never change. So now, guys, we just gotta find some... Oh, gosh. TNT. That's never fun. We just gotta find some super unlucky guards and ram them into these drills. There's a taker. I guess also I should explain, um, while the guru is nimble, oh gosh, once again, no one will ever play, oh gosh, will ever play like Sly. What the? <laughs> so, you know, you can't do any master thief moves with the guru. All right, let's get this guard over here. I'll be careful, because while you can jump high, um, you cannot double jump when you ride an enemy, so do be careful of that. But other than that, the guru is awesome. But just to mention, you ha the only way you could really be offensive with the guru, like I mean, like um, fight wise, I mean, is by controlling enemies because the guru does not have an attack. He does not even swing his staff around. So you got to be very careful while playing with the guru. Alright, anyway. Is that gonna insta kill? Okay, yeah, it's gonna insta kill. Alright, so we just gotta rinse and repeat this a few times and then we should be good. But other than that, it, it's just fun because in a way, you're playing as a new character and then you get to play as every single enemy on the map and use their moves. Like here, when I, uh, if I can grab this kangaroo again. Oh, I didn't do it correctly. I guess I got too close at the last second. <laughs> I must be dreaming, mate. There we go. The kangaroo can pop smoke bombs, as you saw. Don't know how that helps, other than to make the screen a cluster fudge. <laughs> but that's what he does. Also, we gotta be careful because I don't think we want TNT dropped on us. Oh, speak of the freaking devil. All right. Also, we don't want to run into any walls. As you saw, it doesn't kill the guards. Oh. Yeah, these oh. Guys are I didn't even go near that t that that drill. All right, but anyway, oh, yes, we get to use the coyote. Big. Why was I using jump against square? Don't shoot me. Okay. What? Oh lord. But um, let's go. He can shoot people, although he doesn't stop. Everyone else tends to actually stop moving. He doesn't. But yeah, the guru is so cool like that. Master, you are king. Keep it up. Bentley's got another plan to stick it to these miners. Head for that far rock. Ha, ah, but you just got to be careful traversing the environment when you don't have a lackey to ride. Because the lackeys definitely give you a um, environment buff, if that's even what the way you could call it. But yeah, the guru's awesome, man. I'm done yapping like that. <laughs> anyway, how are you guys doing today? I'm doing pretty good myself. Had to be bringing you guys back some more Sly 3. We apologize for today's episode being a little on the late side. Oh, that was weird. You can actually... Okay, you can interact with those, but it... Oh, wow, the guy kept moving. It does throw you off of it, though. Oh, get on him. Oh, that's a close one. Okay. I think I can jump from there. Yeah. Oh, cool. And luckily, you can jump right back onto an enemy. He knows! Kill him! Are you guys fighting me? Can't tell because I can't stop. Anyway, so what? oh, I gotta go right here. That grinder is tearing up Wave Rock. I know it's awful. However, the linked generator is weak, easily destroyed, provided you can jump a few guards over there and ram it. Huh? Oh, don't I? Alright, nice. I was worried I was going to go flying off the edge there. It looks like they actually removed all the guards in my area. That's weird. 
Oh, here we go. Here's someone. <laughs> that guy got blown up by the TNT. That's great. But yeah, hopefully you guys are doing, doing good today. I'm doing pretty good myself. Happy to be bringing you guys back some more slides. I apologize today's episode's going up a little late. Oh, don't you dare. Okay. Um, just been really busy with homework and stuff, and I had to talk to an advisor so I had to move my schedule around at school so I do apologize about that and since I'm using Premiere it takes longer to render out these videos so just patience guys because you guys are getting some really beautiful quality stuff though All right. oh I went right into the water yeah that happens you die well no you don't die but you get screwed into the water too okay I gotta go find guy. Is that a skull? That is a skull. <laughs> That's a... I, I don't know. Wait, the crocodiles are alligators. I don't know. I'm not even getting started. Right, this guy looks like a prime candidate. Let's go for him. Come on. Alright, we don't give you running close to him. Otherwise, we'll take him off. Okay. I was like, are you gonna go up the step? And then when I got thrown off, I was like, don't you dare die. But yeah, as you can see, uh, the guards do have a good amount of health to them, so you can, like, screw up a few times controlling them wise before they actually do die. And luckily, the game gave them really nice jumps, too. Oh, I'm supposed to go this way. Again, I'll turn around. Aye, aye, aye. I'm tired, guys. I need to really fix my sleep schedule. I've been going to bed way too freaking late. Like, I gotta just find better times to record in general. Because I got myself used to recording constantly. And what I would do is... Okay, let's just... Oh, no, he saw me. What I would do was... I would record as soon as I got off of work. Last night, my mom kind of sidetracked me with some stuff. We were watching something together. I cannot remember for the life of me what it was. I think it was like a political thing. I don't want to get into that right now. But anyway, I was watching something with my mom. And, uh, next thing you know... Oh, it's 11 o'clock! Bim, bim. Anyway, but yeah, just by the time I checked the time, it was really late, and I was tired from work, so I went straight to bed. So that's pretty much why today's episode is late. <laughs> The Guru has agreed to join our team, provided we can rid his homeland of the Dingo Miners and deal with the Mask of Dark Earth. A tall order, but we're up for it. First, we'll enlist the aid of some local wildlife to help fit out the Miners' ranks. Murray will feed our foes to a local giant crocodile. With some luck, he'll take a liking to the taste of Miners and chow down on them left and right. Second, we'll hit these guys where they live, or at least relax. If we can clear them out of this lemonade bar, it'll be a crippling blow to their morale. They'll be begging to go home. And finally, Sly will use some mining equipment to drill for radioactive oil deep beneath the dried lake bed. Trust me, it's the key to getting rid of the mask of dark earth. Okay. I just want to say, I really want to do the uh, the lemonade bar mission so badly. Also, this place looks really nice at night, I gotta admit. Lemon Rage. I want to do Lemon Rage so badly. That is a really fun mission, guys. Also, yeah, you guys have probably seen the thumbnail by now, but I'm starting to get ideas for the thumbnail, and I think I'm going to enjoy my idea for the thumbnail. Also, that's what I meant by the loud takedown. That guy's heard me knock that other guy out so hopefully we can get that silent takedown soon anyway let's jump into this mission all right boys look tough and get angry it's time to intimidate the locals i'm not sure i can do it how do you guys get angry find the match deep inside yourself light it and let the fire burn up your guts and boil your blood uh, yeah, I pretty much do the same thing. Look, our goal is to drive away these miners, and we'll do whatever it takes. Oh boy, guys, here we go. <laughs> First off, this amazing music.
listen up, dirtbags. Time to clear out. From now on, this bar is Cooper Gang Turf. Tough, tough, wagga. But you ain't got no respect with us. We here are known around these parts for our drinking skills. And this just happens to be a lemonade bar. Sly, I'm not sure this is such a good idea. If a lemonade drinking challenge is what you had in mind, then the three of us will take on the best three lemonade drinkers you've got. Fair dinkum. Losers have to clear out. We're not even fighting them. We're having a lemonade drinking contest. Ready, steady, go! So this is literally just a button mashing contest. So I just gotta mash the buttons as fast as I can! Ah! Also, maybe I'm confusing- Oh, oh, Murray can start drinking. Alright, so that's how it works. So it's almost like a baton race in the Olympics. Alright. Go, Bentley, go! Oh, look at Bentley chug like a pro. Oh, man! Ah! I think Bentley has a delay to him, too. Oh, gosh, that guy's drinking so fast! Go, Bentley, go! Bentley definitely has a delay! Yes! We win. That's cheating! Why, the... Turtle spill more than he drank. Round here, there's only one thing we do with cheaters. Turn on the fence, Bruce. It's time we gave these cheaters a beating. Now we fight. <laughs> oh, cool. We get to play as Bentley. All right. I think what we want to do is we want to be throwing them into the electric fence because that'll be an insta kill for them. They don't jump over my wheelchair. <laughs> oh, okay. You guys got this? All right. I'll, I'll just go in the corner here. All right. Have fun, guys. Oh. Bombs away! Oh gosh. Oh, what's this do? Oh, I had a feeling it would do that. <laughs> oh gosh, how did I get burned from all the way over there? Oh lord. This is great. It's also awesome to be able to see Sly and Murray and Bentley fight at the same time. Right as rain, pal. Oh, now we switch. Oh, now I remember why I like this mission so much. You get to switch between all three of the guys. Oh, it's so Cool. Boop, 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 boop. Super spin to win. <laughs> now this is—it's such a cool mission seeing the guys all fight together, and then being able to switch. It's just so awesome. This is a PS2 game. It really makes me sad when I go play Slide Four, and it's like it's five-minute loading screen. But oh well. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, this is just so awesome. Oh nice, I actually hit him with that. This hitbox is not as big as I thought it was. They just keep coming. You holding up, Murray? Onto the Murray! Behold! My powers of destruction! Oh man, Murray can just two punch him. Give it to him, pal. Hey guys, just give Murray the guys a fight. Oh my lord. Goodness. They're spawning quite quickly. Oh, I was gonna say, I didn't get hit at all. And then I got hit. Of course, it'd be the whip guy. Excellent hit, Murray! Nice! I knocked them both into the fire. Looks like that's the last guy. Yes! The Cooper Gang rules the roost. We're the kings of the hill. The totally maxed out heavyweight champions. Those guys won't be coming back here anytime soon. Um, guys, looks like they saved their big guy for last. He's wearing that freaky bad spirit mask. He must be so jacked. We should work together to take this guy down. That mask has a powerful force in it. Team 
comes a Drago Mazadax! You know it's bad when he took out the electric fence and a whole friggin' bar. Alright. So now we gotta let Murray and Bentley stun him, apparently. Oh god, these camp angles. Okay, let's let him run into the bomb. Get him while he's dazed! Oh, ow, ow, ow. Okay, Murray's trying to do something real quick here. Okay, Murray, got a shot lined up. I'll try to knock him out with this barrel! Ow, ow, ow! Thank you, Murray. Oh, yes, and fire. Or no, I guess he doesn't take fire damage. Also, I keep trying to do this, the spin move, but because it's like a locked combat fight, I can't. Bob's ready! Right. I have to get away from him first. Oh gosh. Got a barrel here! Come on, Murray, throw it! Ah! Bibbidi bop! Who's next, Murray or Bentley? Murray, right, Bentley's next. Come on, Bentley! Bob's down! Ouch. Oh, did I die? Oh, crap, I died. Oh, God, from the very beginning? Very beginning. Oh, boy. Don't mean me, I'm just super spinning to win. Oh, I, I beat their mates. I, okay, I'm not. I'm just, okay. Lead him over my Bob and I'll pull the trigger. Get him while he's dazed. Right, we're just gonna make sure we don't get in that blast radius. Dang it. We beat their spindle. How could I do that? There we go. That, now it's not an innuendo. Now it's not something barrel. disgusting. Right, come on, Murray. Woo! Right, I just gotta be careful and not get up close with them. And not get in Bentley's bomb blast radius. When it's got the red circle, then it'll blow up when he's close. Right, there we go. There we go. This is going so slow. Okay, ah, yeah, 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 yeah. Not get close to him. I'm trying to get far away from him now so I can do the spin. Okay, nope, it will not let me. Wow, the uppercut does so much damage. Holy crap. You see that? Okay, I'm gonna try it again. Just uppercuts. Okay. Oh my gosh, the uppercut does so much freaking damage, man. Okay. Ready with a barrel! Go on. Alright, I was alternating there. I don't know, maybe I'm just losing my mind and I can't tell anymore. Oh, don't hurt me, please. I'll set with the bomb. Okay, there we go. Alright, looks like we gotta do it one more time. Alright, Murray, make this barrel count, my dude. I'm packing, Sly! Bam! And the Finally, mask leaves. That guy was the mask it's getting away we might have cleared out this bar but that mask is sure to keep making trouble for us we need to destroy it and then awesome enough we get the entire gang and the uh, i just love the attention to detail in this game guys Sly 3 is, pr is so good. It's probably like one of my favorites out of besides Sly 4. Because Sly 4, like Uncharted 4, is just like nostalgia for those who have been with the series so long. Alright, with that, Bentley and Murray split up. And we're good to go. Alright, so I'm thinking next time we'll be doing Hungry Clock. Cl Hungry Croc and then the Claw. And I think that'll line us up for ending off this chapter. So if you guys enjoyed this episode of Sly 3, guys, I'm going to end this episode off here. So you guys enjoyed, be sure to thunderbolt that like button, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace!